Hey guys, welcome back. It's Ron, and I got you some more boating news. But before we get started, make sure you hit that like and subscribe, that notification button to get all the updates that I put out. Now, guys, this happened on 5 11 of 2024. I know it was a few days ago, but the Coast Guard rescued five boaters in under three hours near Tampa Bay. And what it was, the Coast Guard sector of St. Petersburg uh, watch standards received a distress call through the VHF radio on Channel 16 around 11 uh, 15 in the afternoon. And from there, there were four men on a sinking boat, 24 foot, a sinking boat near the Grady Bridge. Now, Station St. Petersburg were, was able to recover the guys and take them back, and no injuries were reported. Now, guys, the next article I have for you, and this comes from uh, the Florida Fish and Wildlife, and this is pretty sad. I've always said that people need to be cautious when they're out on the water, but this happened on May 11th. There was a 15-year-old girl that apparently fell off a uh, jet ski near a sandbar in Key Biscayne near Nixon Beach. And what happened was there was a vessel, apparently a vessel, ran over and she died, and, which is a tragedy. When you're out on the boat, you need to make sure that you're in control. You're aware of what's around you. So I'm going to read you the description of the vessel because, you know, yeah, it's a really bad tragedy to a person what happened, but it was a hit and run. They didn't stop at all after they hit this 15-year-old girl. So I'm going to read you a description of what they're looking for, and maybe you guys can help out. So the witnesses or anyone with information on the boating accident that occurred at approximately 4.30 p.m. on May 11th in Miami are asked to come forward. A juvenile was water skiing near Nixon Beach in Key Biscayne when she he was hit by a vessel. The juvenile died from her injuries. Our officers are looking for a vessel that struck her. It was last seen heading westbound from Nixon Beach, and it was described as a center console boat with light blue hull. The, hull, the boat has multiple white outboard end motors, and it may have been a blue or a dark blue bottom paint. The FWC asked anyone who witnessed the accident or anyone who may have video footage or information to call the wildlife hotline at 888-404-FWCC or 3922 or Miami Crime Stoppers at 305-471-TIPS and that's 8 Four seven seven, you know this. These people, they go get out in these boats and they start hauling ass, and they're not aware of what's around them. And it's a tragedy. I've heard of things where maybe in Port of Miami they're going to stow a possible uh, speed zone. Maybe they need to do it in Biscayne Bay or area other areas like uh, Hollower Inlet. But uh, this is a tragedy that shouldn't have happened. And if you guys have any information about the, the, this uh, incident, please contact the Florida Fish and Wildlife Commission. Anyway, guys, make sure you like and subscribe. Hit the notification button for any updates that I put out. And check out our partner channel from Boat Mania from Hollower Inlet. And I appreciate you very much. And maybe we can get the, the FWC and the family some closure in this event. You guys have a great one. We'll see you on the next video.